Good evening and welcome. First and foremost, thank you for the opportunity to the Grantham College for allowing me to be here and address you this evening. I'm very sorry I can't be here in person. I've uh, travel arrangements and family commitments, I'm afraid, uh, but I'm so honored to be, have the opportunity to talk to you guys tonight. My name is Tony Minahan, and I have the privilege and honor to be at Grantham College between the early 80s and the end of the 80s. Um, I currently uh, live in the United States of America and I've been in the US for 13 years. First and foremost, without Grantham College helping me build a great foundation of education and the ability to improve and build on my social skills, I would not have achieved the accolades and stature I am today. So the first thing I'm going to say to students in the room tonight is be the best you can be and really it's up to you. It's what you put in, you will benefit later in your career. So my career started uh, pretty much after I left Grantham College. I worked for a national engineering company and I was very fortunate at a very young age to be responsible for many multi-million pound engineering construction projects across the UK. From then I did some work in Europe. I worked for some major pharmaceutical companies and really that was a springboard for me then to go and live in the United States of America. So perhaps I could tell you about two or three projects and perhaps a, from a personal story I could share with you this evening. I was very honored to lead a project team locally here in the East Midlands uh, to build the new uh, East Midlands Airport expansion wing. Probably many of you use that now to fly out to, uh, to various parts around the world. Uh, that was a very fast track project, um, very quick, 36 weeks, big construction team, and I was the project director for that project. And it was so successful, uh, I was awarded uh, CIOB Project Manager of the Year in London. I was on stage with the uh, BBC uh, television people for an interview, and um, it was a wonderful project, and it goes to show from the skills here at Grantham College, when they're apl applied correctly, uh, it sky's the limit. So that's a very special project for me locally. I have recently uh, had the privilege to lead at the construction of a new cancer research center in Boston, Massachusetts. It was a four year journey for many people and many millions of dollars. I was so honored as well to have built a cancer research center, having lost my sister from breast cancer. And perhaps lastly, uh, from a social perspective, um, some recent events uh, myself and my family had gone through in the Boston Marathon uh, in 2013. So I'd never done a marathon before in my life and my oldest son uh, decided to uh, train his father uh, to run a marathon. And fortunately on the day itself, uh, it wasn't to be for me. I, I was stopped half a mile from the end of the Boston Marathon and uh, I was shattered, um, not only because of the, how the day started off in so, so brightly, but for the amount of charities we were running for, but for the end, to, end so sadly for those four families. So in true Grantham College spirit, I did it again. 20 days later, I flew to Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, me and my son, and we did the whole marathon again. So it goes to show, if you have determination to succeed and you apply it, you can be anything you want to be and achieve the biggest accolades. Perhaps tonight, you won't see that, but it's the work you do now in the next few years will be so impactful for your career, not just professionally, but socially. So, as a student sitting there this evening, you might ask yourself, what has it been for me? Well, I sat there 30 years ago and I had a dream. And my dream was to be the best I could be and give back on the way through and also enjoy myself. And I certainly did that at the time at Grantham College, but with balance and moderation. The biggest thing I can ask you guys to do is follow your dream and whatever your dream is, do it the best you can be. But some words of advice. Your friends today at college also might be in the interview line when you go for your first job interview. So it's important to do the best you can every single day. The other thing I'll say is when I was at college, I was really against 
my, my, my friends in a very limited geographical area, i.e. Grantham, Lincolnshire, Nottingham. Today, guys, you're up against national competition and in some cases, in some careers, international competition. Employers today across the world only want the best students. They're very selective and it's very difficult to secure a position at many companies across the world. So it's really important, again, to have a dream, but be the best you can be by your dream. Martin Luther King was a wonderful, inspirational leader of our time. He said many impactful things, but it's now it's your time. It's your time to make a difference. And if you make the difference, I will guarantee you, be the best you can be, you'll end up being where you need to be in, in, in years to come. I would have never have dreamed in 1987, I'll be working for an international company in the United States of America, helping to find the cure for cancer. And it's only because of the foundation the Grantham College afforded me very early on in my career. And I am so thankful again for the opportunity to say these few words with you tonight. Thank you very much and good evening.